Good morning. It is Friday, which is my favorite. Today I have mixed emotions. Yes, it's Friday, which is my favorite. However, it is Autumn's last day of work with us this summer before she goes back to school. I'm going to do something special for her today. She has done an excellent job editing and shooting video for us all summer long. Uh, she just far exceeded my expectations for her. Uh, she's been doing awesome. She really took what I gave her and went way out in front of what I ever even have done. So that's been pretty cool. So we'll say goodbye to Autumn today. It's also a good day on the other hand because this is our last work day before I take my vacation. By the time you see this, I'll already be back. But for me today, right now, this is it. We're going to work today and then uh, we're going to leave for vacation for an entire week. I'm looking forward to it. As you guys know, I bought this deck boat and we're going to have an absolute blast on this thing. I bought tubes and I bought a lily pad and I bought a knee board. I bought like everything that you need to have all kinds of fun on the lake. I'm also taking my, my little fishing boat here. It's a 17 foot aluminum fishing boat. It's really nice. I got really good electronics on there and a good trolley motor. I enjoy fishing, but I never get to go. But next week, hopefully we will be catching some fish. So we're doing something a little bit different today. We're not pouring concrete. We're not doing a concrete job at all. What we're gonna do is we're gonna go mow some grass, do some landscaping. I know there's a lot of landscapers that tune into this channel and subscribe and I used to, do commercial lawn maintenance for any of you new subscribers that used to be part of my business but then last year I got so busy with concrete I got so busy with YouTube I sold that portion of the business off to the employee that I have now Mike and Mike owns the accounts he owns my old equipment I sold him a truck and all that kind of stuff but today we're gonna go help him out most some of the accounts that I'm already familiar with He's got his own mowers and I'm going to take my skag. I'm going to bring some of the guys and we're going to go do some mowing. It should be pretty cool. It should be pretty fun. I haven't mowed anything for quite a long time. I've been having my own employees mow my lawn. I don't think I mowed any grass since last year. So I'm looking forward to a little bit of a change up today. I think you guys will probably like it too. So, all right, well, I got to take this trash out. You already know that and grab some coffee. I'll see you over there. How much garbage do we make? Good job. You get a raise. You get a raise. You're the garbage inspector. Morning, Jewel. Good. How's the coffee business? Good. Good? It's there? Let's see. No, there's still some in there. Good job, Jewel. I'm going to recommend uh, a bonus. Okay. To the management. Morning, Mizzy. Hey, good morning, sir. Good morning, Dwayne. How are you today? Great. It's Friday, which is my favorite. Bye. Yeah, and I'm actually off this week. Well, in theory. Yeah, that's the way it goes when you're the boss, man. Well, I had two Collins in the kitchen already today, so I got one of my Amanda's out in the kitchen now. So. Yeah. It's always something. You have a card, right? It's, it's always something. I like that. All right. Thank you very much. All right, good have a good again. weekend. Good weekend. Yep. Yeah. thing like it's a super bike all right it looks like Daryl's here and he wasn't supposed to be here until 8 and he was also supposed to bring junior and junior's calling me and asking me Daryl senior left junior home today and junior's not happy so I'm gonna go get junior because it's Friday and everybody should be able to enjoy Friday junior doesn't doesn't want to sit at home all right, I'm coming to pick up Junior. I see him up there. He's waiting. His dad took off this morning without him. I can't believe it. I think Daryl's going to be uh, surprised to see Daryl Junior with me <laughs> when I pull in the yard. Look at him. He's smiling so big already. I knew he'd be happy. Look at him. I love that smile. 
morning. You ready? Yes, sir. Hey, I can't believe your dad left without you. I know. That's I didn't know that you left your dad until he called me a little bit ago. How are we going to work without the big boss man? Right? I didn't want to miss today. I know. It's Autumn's last day, too. <laughs> oh, I got a card for her. You got to sign it. Everybody's going to sign it. Now you're getting used to signing your autograph, huh? Yeah. <laughs> I'm really used to it. <laughs> Morning. Morning. How much garbage do you make? That's we make family. Yeah, I see that, man. That's that's pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. Nice work. Yeah. Have a good day. You too. Perfect. Wow, you took up a whole side though. <laughs> <laughs> everybody, else, everybody else still needs room, you know. Wow. Oh, they're gonna. Have, that, 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 they're gonna have to. They're gonna have to write small. All right, we're pulling back into the yard with the big boss, man. That's right. Yep. Are you going to go get yell at your dad? <laughs> yeah, of course oh. I am. All right. Okay, go ahead and yell at him. All right. Thank you for bringing me in this morning, Dad. I appreciate it. Hey. I can't believe you left your son at home. I was up on, early anyway. On a Friday. The best day. Yeah. Junior, like you were up at 5 o'clock in the morning. I was. See? I seriously was. I came here earlier and you were sleeping in the front seat. You had all that time you could have picked him up. Yeah. And now he's calling me, please pick me up, please pick Is me that up. what he said? Yes. You didn't come here early and see me in the front seat sleeping. Yes, I did. You were laying down on the front seat. I saw you. I was taking a nap. You can't say I did. I got it on camera. <laughs> yeah, right. Oh, man. <laughs> so there, all right. Exactly. Hey. We got to pull weeds and mow the grass. <laughs> well, for who? For Mike. Mike. Yeah, we're helping Mike today. Oh, that's why. You're pulling weeds, big boss man. Pulling oh, weeds? Yes, sir. Man. I'll go get you some gloves right now. You're going to need a pair of these. Oh. You better find a pair. He's all happy. Look at He's all happy. You'll be happy until he's down on his knees for an hour. Big bonus for pulling weeds? Do you think you get a bonus for pulling weeds? Come on, Daryl. Well, it's for his company, not yours. I'm paying you, <laughs> not him. We're just helping him out. You have to pay us. I am paying you, but I ain't giving you a bonus. <laughs> Mike's got to pay you to pay us. No, we're, I'm just going to help Mike out for no charge. <laughs> He's getting behind, so I told him we help him. You got to sign Autumn's card. It's her last oh, day today. That's right. Daryl Jr. took up half the card, so... <laughs> oh my goodness! You gotta write small. <laughs> yeah, write tiny. Yeah. Yeah. Eric's here! Morning, Eric. It's too early for that, man. How's it going? So, a couple things. First thing is, you're gonna need a pair of gloves for picking weeds. And then the second thing, you gotta sign Autumn's card. It's her last day. Oh, that's right. Last day. Daryl, what do you have there now? The rock'em sock'ems. Yeah, I do. <laughs> Punch. Another one. Yeah, there you go. There you left go. Right. Left, right. You gotta go left, right, right. <laughs> you see, we got a oh. black eye. Black eye. Where'd you get that? Northside. At the gas station. Oh, it's got it's <laughs> got candy in it still. Marcel's here. Morning. Francisco's here. He's two minutes late though. Oh. I'm gonna have to go let him go. Yeah, I'm like, serious. Be like, oh, Daryl Jr. Good. literally disconnected your trailer. Wow. Oh, and then he walks break. over by me. He's like, I disconnected the trailer for Marcel. Like this. Francisco's here. Hey, uh, start time today was eight o'clock, and you pulled in at eight o two. I'm sorry, I gotta let you go. Now your shirt sure is so dirty. Uh -huh. no. You know what I should do? I should I'm get some red know. spray paint every morning. Every I could just paint the shirt. It's like you just left work. <laughs> no, I was going to. I couldn't because my washer broke. Should we go to your house so we can use your washer today? Oh, you think my wife would let you can put that shirt in the washer? Not a chance. Oh not a chance. Just don't show it. She would be like, not right? today. We got a brand new I washing know, machine. Really? Washing oh no, I got two. I got two. Oh, you do? Yeah, I got an old one and a new one. I use old the old one is for yeah. the work clothes, because yes, especially when you're stamping, man. Oh, oh, that God. stuff gets so bad. Yeah, it really is. is. All right, we're out of here. We're gonna go meet Mike on the uh, the account. A lot of weeds up there for you, Junior. Reach your big boy, man. 
All right, we're here. Oh, look at all those weeds right there. Oh, oh man. Look at, oh. look at Marcel. We literally just got here. Wow. You can't see me. Mike's here. Those are my two old Gravelys and then my Skag that I just bought last year. That one's mine, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Morning. Morning. Did you steal my mower? I did. Okay. <laughs> what do you got to do? This and that and? Uh, this and that and then the ponds. Okay. All right, I'm gonna go get Autumn because she's probably. No, that's Are they yours? Yeah, yeah oh, Mike my... buys porta johns for every mowing job. Yeah. <laughs> Man, I hear a professional. <laughs> he is a, he's a pro. Autumn's here. Morning. Morning. It's your last day. Oh. Yep. Last day. We're starting in the back. Okay, I'll see you there. Yeah, just park right back there. Autumn's last day. What a sad day. All right, we're here at the first place. We're gonna help Mike out. We'll be pulling a lot of weeds today. Doing some mowing today. Trimming and blowing. All the fun stuff. So this place is pretty good size it's all back here there's a big lawn up there all around the sides this is a big building and then the front as well there's a lot of a lot of trimming here since we're all here I got something for you so it's autumn's last day so here's a card for you with a little gift for you for your wonderful Thank editing. You did was good. Yep. Awesome Thank you for making me famous. Very good video. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Daryl took up a half a page. <laughs> <laughs> Daryl Jr., you he wrote big. Thank you. Yep. You're welcome. Now open the check. Look wow. at that smile. Wow. <laughs> 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 She's like. <laughs> so everybody's going to want to know, but I gave Autumn $2,000 for the camera that she wants to buy. Nice. Yeah, yeah. Yes. He's going to make it into his clothes. <laughs> thank you. You're welcome. Oh, thank you. <laughs> yep. We couldn't have done it without you. No, nope, I would have died this summer if I had to edit every video. I would have. I would have been dead. Hey, Daryl the Destroyer, he's got to use yours, not mine. <laughs> mine is way nicer. You already asked me which one he's using this morning. It's oh. probably yours. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> oh, good job, Francisco. <laughs> you just, I got a you killed it. Bottle. Man. Francisco, you gotta learn how to use that thing. I know, he's just swinging everywhere. Whoa, look at. Francisco! The glasses aren't gonna save your eyes up there. Doing a good job so far? Doing a great job. All right. What are you doing, Daryl? Don't even say that. You gotta put the brake on. Put the brake on. Open those. Now start it. <laughs> sure, Daryl. I was. Uh-huh. It was the angle. Sure. No. Not really? Wow. Nice work. 
Yeah, right. Oh, look at look at Junior's driving. Oh no. Oh no, no, no. Look at the boss. Hey, he looks like a boss now. Look at him. Look at Look at boss. He knows how to drive. He does? Obviously. Hey boss. Oh. Are you just it looks like you're a supervisor. Okay. Yeah, he's got the light on. He's ready. We're gonna work right there. Did you see that one-handed? He's like one-handed Eric. He's so happy right now. He feels like the real boss right now. And he's got the dually. Uh, so first we need to move this truck because Daryl parked it right in the handicap parking sideways oh. and Triple parked it. So we should probably move that first. Daryl, why would you park right in the handicap? What if somebody sick comes and then the big truck's in the way? Well, oh, mom. Well, Grandma's here. You bought us something? It's for Autumn's last day. Surprise. Autumn's last day surprise. Oh. Muffins and chocolate milk. Oh, oh. 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 homemade oh. grandma muffins. No, they're not homemade. Yes. Grandma, don't say that. Choice. You're supposed to say yes. You're supposed to say yes. I don't want to lie. Homemade oh. grandma muffins. Ladies first. It looks just like the it looks just like the ones you buy from Costco. They are. Oh. Look at they just give you Autumn. Wow. Autumn gets first first choice of muffins. What? Autumn, show tell Grandma what you got for your gift from us. The camera. Really? Yep. She's gonna be best. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Trust me, I know. Back. Better come back next year. <laughs> yeah. Come on, dude. You don't want a muffin? I don't really eat this one. Like, well, take it home. <sighs> right, no right in grandma. grandma's heart. You, can say no to grandma, you can't just have a little piece. <sighs> hey, Mike, seen these muffins? Did you see that smile? I know. Did you see that smile? Mike, yeah, we're having smile. a celebration here. Yeah. Yeah. Mike, we see, we seen that smile. <laughs> when he saw the muffins. Thank you. Good Chocolate milk and muffins. Thank you. Yeah, Autumn, everybody wants your autograph before you leave. You gotta sign everybody's hats. Yeah. I already got it. Yeah, you did. On the inside? Alright, for those of you who are newer to the channel, you might not know that I used to do commercial landscape maintenance along with my concrete work, but last summer I got too busy doing YouTube and concrete and I sold all the landscape maintenance accounts and the equipment to Mike. Now Mike is working part-time for me and then he's taking care of the accounts and he does the snow removal here too, but so these are my old accounts and uh, I don't miss it, I'll tell you. I mean, it's nice, it's kind of fun today, obviously, we're having a good time, but I don't like doing it all summer long. It's just not for me, but Mike loves it. Right, Mike? Oh, it's great. Yeah, <laughs> yep. So we're gonna help Mike pull some weeds here in a couple minutes, which is everybody's favorite. Even mine. Yeah, right. You ready to pull some weeds? <laughs> not today. <laughs> oh, you're pulling weeds, buddy. I didn't give you those gloves for nothing. Are you ready for weeds? Yeah, let's pull weeds. Come Did on, hurry up. That's the kind of enthusiasm we're looking for. You want to pull weeds? Not today. Oh! <laughs> no. Right the Autumn? No. Come yeah. on. You got to hold the camera, right? Yeah. Yeah. That's you you want to run the mower? Sure. All right. Okay. Come over here. I'll show you. Just stand right here. And then hold on. Leave it low. I don't want to go, really. Well, just super slow. Oh. See? People are driving by my mom like, what in the world? Yeah, it's awesome. She doesn't want to get off. Look at her. No. Also, she just starts cutting the grass. She does really Zipping good. Zipping around in the back on the hill. Oh, man. She's getting the hang of it. Look at that. She's getting the hang of it. I know. You see that? 
She's better than Daryl already. I know. That's perfect because when we get home, she can mow my lawn. <laughs> I like your car. Right. Take 2,500 cash right now. I got the whole back 40 done. All right. My mom knocked out the back 40 acres already with that. All right. <laughs> yeah. Good job. Thank you. It is fun. So we're gonna weed right over, start weeding. You got your gloves? You got your yep, gloves? You I got, got your gloves? gloves? Mike, how'd you let this get so bad? Right. These weeds are like four foot tall or better. These are weeds? Yeah. Yeah, those, those tall ones, those oh. really tall ones are all weeds. Really? Yeah. I, think I thought they were plants. <laughs> I think I don't feel good, right? Oh, I think, oh, I don't think I don't feel good. Oh, those muffins. Yeah. I gotta get all the dirt off this one. Ow! Oh. There we go. That's a weed that do it. Yep, perfect. Got it. Ow! So we just finished this place, we finished that place, and uh, I gotta run and get checks, and I'm gonna meet the guys over at some really, really big retention ponds that gotta get done. Well, I went to go get checks, and I got a call 10 minutes after I left. And apparently Francisco drove the mower into the pond. I have no idea what Francisco is doing on the mower, so I asked, because he's never run a mower, and I, apparently Eric was trying to teach him how to use the mower. I think Mike coming back with a strap. It's the stand up. They just have to pull it out of the pond. Autumn's over there, so she'll get the video. Epic fail. Love to see. <laughs> park it, park it, Daryl. <gasps> Watch out for my car. <laughs> the front wheel is barely touching. <laughs> <laughs> wow. This guy here, big boss man, is going to come and tell me the whole story. I can see it already in his face and his smile. Look at how excited he is to tell me the story. Look at this. It'd be something interesting that happened. Something inter interesting happened? What is that? So, Francisco was mowing and he got the mower stuck in the pond over there. So my dad and my son had to get the mower out. We borrowed a landscaper straps? Well, at least we had somebody to help us. Yeah. Man. Big shout out to these guys <laughs> who helped us get our mower out. Badgerland. That's enough excitement for this Friday. Yep. Got it out? Yeah. That's good. 
but I'm not attempting that over there. Why are you so scared? He's got slicks on there. I know, those are good though. They're really not. <laughs> One's We're flat. <laughs> you see me? Yeah. Hi. Hi. Why are you standing there like that? I don't know. You want your money? Me and Marcel let him go on the uh, red one that you stand on. Somebody was like doing a wheelie down there. No way, really? <laughs> no. <laughs> you, were you were popping a wheelie? <laughs> all right. <laughs> nice. So the guys are all working on these big retention ponds here. It's a lot to do, and uh, there's some pretty steep banks. You guys saw down here, this is the spot where Daryl went into the pond last year. One of my guys, Craig, flipped my stander, the same stander you see there, the gravely upside down in the pond, a few years ago. Where was Francisco? Where did he get stuck? Right there? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know what he was doing over there anyway. He was like half coming down the hill. Then he turns the mower off and forgot to put it in park, so it starts going down the hill backwards. Oh! And the guy was, we were all so scared. And the guy <laughs> <laughs> what guy? The guys. There were some guys. The guys that oh, the landscapers the guys. The guy with the truck was laughing at Francisco. <laughs> <laughs> so hard. He's like, I'll be scared too, man. Hey, Francisco was like this. Oh, he just jumped off. Well, Autumn just showed me the time lapse. He basically turned and went straight down the hill. <laughs> straight down the hill into the pond all right we're all done with everything i didn't show everything but i think you'll get a good idea of what we did some pretty large scale stuff some smaller places and then there's some places that you didn't see at all but watching people mow for a long period of time it kind of gets monotonous i've noticed that i've paid attention to like uh, landscape channels and mowing channels it seems like there's a ceiling on how big the channel can grow because you can kind of only watch so much of the same thing for so long uh, that's why a lot of the mowing channels kind of reverted over to like uh, doing, you know, free mowing jobs for the elderly and helping the veterans and all that stuff. So that fad kind of caught on. So they're all gravitating towards that because that actually seems to be working. But we're done for today. I just thought it'd be pretty fun to, you know, watch us do something a little bit different for once instead of concrete. Uh, I used to do these accounts all the time. Very familiar with it. Daryl, I heard you got a little chance to hop on the mower. How'd that go? Oh, it was fun. Yeah. Yeah, just like riding the driving the next meter and bobcat, only standing up. All right, well, I'll see you guys on the next one. Adios. 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 That's your last adios for a no. whole season. Ugh. Adios. Adios. Hey, Francisco, I heard there was a little uh, mishap with the mower. Is that? I never want to talk about it. What happened for real? <laughs> Francisco the Destroyer. Yeah. At least, at least it wasn't the skag. Speaking yeah. of the skag, where is it? Daryl has over there. Hey. Oh no, don't say that. And he hasn't been back for a while. Oh. He's probably trying to fish for it. He's swimming down there. Where is it? Yeah. Now you're all full of grass instead of full of concrete. Right. How's it feel? I don't like it. I don't like it. Sorry, Mike. Sorry, Mike. Look at look at you. It's it's in your mustache, on your face. Look at that. Glasses. Yeah, everywhere. Yeah, so the biggest secret to mowing on slopes is never get the front end tilted towards the downhill slope. You have to be straight sideways, parallel with the water's edge. Once you get that front end pointed down, there's nothing you can do. You're going all the way down. It's over. You might as well just get off because you're not stopping it. Why do you seem so? Why do you seem so like uh, down? No, I'm good. I mean, you'll recover emotionally in a day or two. <laughs> <laughs> yeah yeah you won't be able to sleep all weekend right? having nightmares about going towards the water <laughs> and he doesn't even know how to swim <laughs> hey, he thought he was gonna die <laughs> so you really thought you were gonna die because he saw the water <laughs> no wonder no wonder <laughs> no one no, i'm dead all right i guess that's it i'll see you guys after my vacation thank you Tour and enjoy yourself. We found you. For sure, for sure. I'll do that on Friday. I'm gonna miss you guys. <laughs> gonna miss you. Autumn, oh, autumn's coming. Autumn. Yeah. Hey, we'll send. Nice working with you. We'll send you a little uh, shot of us tubing. You guys will be so jealous. Yeah. All right. You just want the mower put back where it was. Yeah, so same spot. Yeah. <laughs> okay. See you, Daryl. Uh, see you right Yep. Yes, sir. All right. We're not quite done for the day. Just got back to the house. I did an estimate. We're going to take the Crown Vic into the performance shop. Finally, today, it's going to get a supercharger. It's going to get a full exhaust. It's going to get some other stuff. And it should be 
loud and fast and capable of smoking the tires right off the rim when I get it back. Maybe a big blower in the center? No, we're not getting a blower, <laughs> <Okay>. Daryl. We're <laughs> getting a supercharger. Yes! Man, purrs like a kitten though. All right, you ready? Yes, sir. All right. I'm good. Yep, let's go <laughs> drop the Crown Vic off. I've been waiting to do this for a long time. It's been almost like getting close to three months since I ordered this stuff. All right, we're finally here. This is a long ways from my house. It's like 45 minutes away. It's called West Bend Dino Tuning. We just don't have a lot or any performance shops around where I live. <clears throat> we had another one, but they don't do performance work anymore. They only sell parts, which is interesting. How's it going? Good, how are you? Not too bad. I'm dropping off of the Crown Vic. Okay, gotcha. For the supercharger. Ryan, right? <laughs> yeah, Ryan. Okay. So there's the key. Okay, cool. Yep. And don't and don't blow up the motor, please. Thank you. All right, you guys got my information, uh, so yeah. I guess yeah. that's it. He said they've never blown up a car on the dyno in how many years? Well, he's been here two years. Two years, but man, I don't think they're trying hard enough. No. I'm just saying, I don't think they're going. I don't think they're going for big power. No. They should be blowing up cars left and right. I know I would. <laughs> oh, I know Boom. you. I know Sorry. you would. All right, we just got back home. I'm dropping the Crown Vic off. Oh man. No way. Is that your puppy? All right. Come. She's, a She's got a lot of energy. It's a girl. Yeah. Wow. Did my wife see it yet? No. I should bring the dog oh, over there. Just, oh, yeah. 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 Go, go take it in. I hope you're not mad I bought something. Are you mad? No, I don't know. Is it a boy or a girl? It's a girl. You like her? Yeah. Look at this dog. It doesn't get any cuter than that. No. <laughs> She's Kevin just got her. She's our neighbor. Our new neighbor dog. It's a girl? Yeah. Did you name her yet? Not yet. It's so cute, I don't even think he would have gotten mad, would you? I, I, I'm not gonna say anything. <laughs> she didn't buy it. Don't you say. She didn't buy it. Aww. She didn't buy She didn't buy it. No. Nope. No. Nope. This is the cutest dog I've ever seen, I have to tell you. She is pretty mellow. I mean, look at the face like that. Yeah. That's so funny. I mean, Dogs don't get much cuter than that right there. That's adorable.